Hello and welcome back to the 41st millennia. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our Warhammer 40k Chaos Gate, a blind playthrough, legendary uh, difficulty with Grandmaster mode activated. Ezyme once again. We have cleansed this planet so often and we need to eliminate seed carriers once again. And if we kill 10 with ranged weapons, we're going to get two additional requisition. We get one on top of it, so four requisition is available here and theoretically a paladin i thought about do i want another paladin nah i want another librarian so here we go uh standard team uh, pretty much uh, standard everything and we're going to go in stratagems will be our classical extra armor extra crit uh, refill for the librarian and extra ap let's go destination located the court of the seven miseries has been spotted within this war zone Nurgle's minions clearly seek out places where death and decay are most rampant. More fuel for the fire of the bloom. We must stop the seeds from taking root here. Okay. That's one. Two. Three. And I saw something over here, yeah. <laughs> okay, sure. Then moves up. I am here to serve. Remember, Saiken, ten need to die, uh, at least nine need to die via ranged attacks. I am here to serve. teleport in at your command there is no need to immediately do it uh, we have all the time in the world as your command Interesting. Now these guys are moving over there. Yes, sir. What is your will? You know what? It's just too damn convenient. My strength returns. Knocks over his own guy. Very nice. Arms at the ready. All right. Uh, so let's start with that. Easy way of dealing 10 points of damage. The enemy is wounded. Teleporting in, we would want to start hitting them. Uh, strength of the spirit, yes please. Everybody gets extra armor, that's fine as well. You can see we can use uh, Strength of the Spirit again. So it's just a matter of which one we're using first, I suppose. Unleash. 
actually. Okay, so that's one down. But it does not count as a kill with a ranged weapon. Good to know. Very good to know. Yes, come on. Ready to serve. But this will get him down to almost killed. Fabulous. Good, that's two. The battle ends in triumph. Extract uh, the seed. No, uh, these guys didn't have the seed. Knights, urge the beasts. Moves to here. Teleports everybody in. Now. Let's start with an extraction. Nice little seat. Go up. Claim the seat. Good. Ranged weapon needs to go. But since we're still in the same round, uh, nothing has changed, so the support fire is no longer working, because we've already done yes, the support fires. Yes, come on. This auto, and I want to hit when we're going in against him. Armor break for some extra damage. Fantastic, that was good. What is your will? Justice. 
How many hit points? 20. Ready to serve. Goes down to almost dead, right? Down to seven. Unleash me. Good, we need to kill as many people with ranged weapons. Still the same round, right? Yes, Commander. My blade is yours. Could give him a little bit more movement speed with that warp speed. Unleash me. Funnily enough, we almost uh, have fully regenerated our um, our last teleportation. Good. Teleport over here. Fabulous, bring it on. That is pretty stupid, but they can simply do that. We have a purification. Well, we're going to figure it out. gone. That's what I was hoping for. Let's get these guys down. In the meantime, 
kill. For finishing the turn. That removes plague. My wrath is restored, brother. That purifies himself. Getting plagued again just because we're standing here. Mm -hmm. Okay, sure. This time. Rara needs to move out anyways. And that's going to be a kill. Last one is right there. Praise the Emperor. Moves to here. That's a little switcheroo. Standing ready. Oh, well, we got exactly five will points. How convenient. Lesser, but definitely more, more fat enemies. That's all the seeds accounted for, Commander, but there are warp disturbances emerging nearby. We will begin teleport extraction immediately. Good. More warp gates. Fair enough. Another seed. By the way... There you go, our librarian has yes, 17 willpower again. <laughs> Very good. Cool. So a couple of things. Number one, purification. Still trying to purify everyone here. At your command. Um, you know what? Why 
why not? Let's go for max stun. fully stunned. think that we can do that again with uh, the Psy Bolter, but there is a chance. dying before that happens unfortunate but he's finally the last Another one down. piece that we need to uh, kill 10 Death enemies Commander. that works out well Curse it. cannot focus Good. Uh, listen, I mean, we're pretty much done here. Blade is ever really done. We got all of our kills that we needed. We come with the Killed every single uh, one that we needed with a ranged weapon. And the quickest way out of here is to simply abort the mission by running away from the enemies. Teleportation is by far the best ability in the entire game. Position. Level protect. Securing position. 
Good. Easy. What is your will? The teleportation is so good because with the way that the mechanic works that you can basically ride one turn. I still have another strength of uh, spirit your left over. Orders. You can basically ride one turn and the only reason why I stopped doing that is because the mission was de facto over. Securing position! <laughs> Securing position! <laughs> Recovery sequence initiating. Cool. Well, easy mission. Good, and look at that, we even got uh, double-digit seats. Because the only thing that would um, be of interest is the shield. And this shield has auto parry twice. Hmm. I mean, I could have a sword that does that. I'm still not seeing why the shield is so dope then. <laughs> Bleed plus five, that's not bad. Yeah, but we're just staying with the reposition. Fabulous. Dan the man. Uh, what are we going to do with you? We wanted this here. I think that's a decent build as well. These guys are almost at level 9. Good. You gotta be a bit careful here with our hull integrity. Alright, let's nonetheless go there. There was always at least another option besides just fighting. Good, we're getting yet another use of the stratagems. Critical breach imminent. Throne. We must act now, Commander. Those tentacles are mutations derived by the bloom. I hate to suggest this, but if we vent some of our seeds into space, they as you say. 
Good. Losing four seats. Pfft. That's nothing. Uh, our hull integrity. We need to get that back, uh, back up. So after we are done with this I would like to build more hull integrity problem is we need servitors for that good here we do have something nice, tier 3 servo scrolls. I love servo scrolls. I think they are the best utility item in the game, as far as I can tell so far. Terminator armor is available as well. And we get a Grimoire. That's not so great, but it's okay. Can't use mastercrafted ranged weapons, but that's okay either. I think we are good to go with the current team just need to take out all of their storm bolters this would be catastrophic for our range only team but since this team here has a very strong focus on melee. I don't see a lot of problems with it. Very good. Did we get anything else? No, in terms of equipment, I think we're fine. In terms of stratagems, willpower, very good. Strength of spirit, very good. High sanctuary, very good. And I think quicksilver isn't bad either. We now can get um, healing or since it happened a couple of times, I'm just going to put in that purif uh, Purify. Very often I felt, man, it would be great to have a Purification now. And then it didn't work for whatever reason. But yeah, if we do this, we're at 8 Requisition. So if the stuff here is good, the Servo Skull and the Terminator Armor, we would have level 3 on that as well. Just out of curiosity, um, our current armor, yeah we only have one level 2 armor, a lot of the terminator armor is just level 1, not that that is anything wrong with that per se. It's just that a level 3 armor potentially could be really good. I could imagine something like you have an extra slot here. And that would be awesome. That would be really awesome. Alright, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, we're nearing a point also in the game where I feel that the research uh, is really picking up the whole stratagems. That's a really great system. It is very Warhammer-like and I, I like how they've implemented it. Um, it's essentially spending command points for those who are familiar with um, Warhammer Tabletop. So yeah, um, once we have that, I still want Words of the Emperor. So we're going through this here next to get to Words of the Emperor because Words of the Emperor uh, will help our stun team uh, quite a bit. Uh, this here looks fine as well, but I have really so far not encountered a lot of situations where that warp search was so bad that I would have never wanted to work with it. I think Willpower 2 is effectively even worse than Willpower 1 because here we get 12 Willpower back on uh, across all of the Knights. Mind you, if someone is near full, then it doesn't do anything. And here, on our uh, Librarian, I get 20 back. 
Yeah, but we're going to research all of that because I think that the Codex uh, Toxicus uh, will drive the storyline forward. And once that is happening, we're sort of on uh, the final uh, final bit. And I would appreciate if we get a little bit more equipment. I'm, I'm, I think I'm doing quite well in terms of equipment, but I can definitely see how this is, uh, becomes a bit of an addiction to just run missions to kind of loot box gamble uh, onto armor and and equipment that is great and to be fair just in terms of pacing of the game right so we wanted to finish with that team that we're currently having the perfect perfectionist uh, in me is not allowing myself to just leave these guys semi-level so they will become level um, level nine eventually and i'm then slowly going to level up the paladin and the chaplain already so that they are sort of on the same um, on the same level as the purifier who is already level uh, five um, and I hope we're going to get a librarian so that we can test the stun team. And I'm still thinking about who the last person for that uh, squad here should be. Uh, Interceptor is the um, most likely, most likely candidate. But yeah, we would need to upgrade the barracks once more. And to be fair, I would really want to upgrade the ship a bit more. There are a couple of upgrades that I simply don't understand. I still haven't really figured out what that stasis chamber is doing, uh, let alone the surgical unit. Uh, yeah, whatever it does, I don't know. Uh, more experience will help us to effectively level our battle brothers a bit uh, faster. Another plus 100 is good but that requires 15 servitors and to be fair we currently have different problems with uh, low hull integrity once again good that's it that's all i had for today thanks a lot for watching guys and if you want to improve our hull integrity then leave a like and a comment down below see you in the next episode bye bye